my dear brothers and sisters in Christ. Today's gospel is an exhibition of how true integrity and authority can work. Termindo's wonders, conversation of heart, and transformation of life. And how it can also cause some people to oppose credibility and authenticity by engaging in culminating and character assassination. We see that today's gospel picks up where last Saturday's gospel ended. And today the scribes accuse Jesus of being possessed by Belgeable. They stated that they believe it's the power of these prince of demons that gave Jesus the power to cast out demons. Also, the people who were listening to Jesus, priests declared that he was out of his mind. But Jesus did not let their comments distract or deter him. He immediately turns to them and questions their declaration and ultimately Jesus tells the people that all sins, all blasphemies will be forgiven. But if someone blasphemies against the Holy Spirit, that one will not be forgiven. So my dear brothers and sisters in Christ, what is our reaction to this gospel? What is the message Jesus has given us today? Is it about blasphemy? Or is Jesus simply trying to free us? This time in our lives, we are the ones who cannot forgive ourselves for something we have done. So we need to ask ourselves what do you, you need to forgive yourselves for? Are you willingly to let Jesus set you free? Today's Gospel calls us to check and examine. Is my prayer life and devotion totally authentic? and credible? Is my preaching and spreading of God's word filled with His Holy Spirit? Is my reception of the sacraments helping me to make an honest effort to be a true Christian? So my dear brothers and sisters in Christ, Jesus is waiting and ready. However, we trust him enough to open our minds and hearts to his love, his forgiveness, and his healing. Just now we pause some moment and reflect on this. God bless us all.